Hello, everybody. This is Michelle. Welcome. I'm not sure. I can't really see who's on. There's a bit of a delay. Okay, yes, I think it's all live. Um, welcome. Um, I'm going to be taking you through a clearing today. Hello, I can see people coming on now. So I'm a quantum healer and a shadow work coach. I work in the Akashic Records. Um, so welcome and thank you for joining me here. I don't have a lot of time to sort of wait for people to come on. So I'm just going to get straight into it because I'm doing a clearing today. Um, but before I get into that, I just want to say a big thank you to you, Catherine, for putting on another summit and for all the love and the effort that you put into the summits and into the group um, generally. So uh, that's much appreciated. Thank you so much. And um, let's get into this. So what I'm doing today is I'm clearing an AI inorganic distortion or lots of AI inorganic distortions out of the energy fields out of all 12 dimensions and that is to support a deeper connection to your divine God truth so I'm not going to be talking too much about what all that means because I need the full 30 minutes pretty much for the clearing but what I can say is that you know this healing journey this ascension journey it's a deep journey it's quite the process as I'm sure you all know it's a mind, body and spirit journey and going through the process of clearing all of this stuff slowly unburdens our light body to, to hold more organic light. So when we're clearing the inorganic stuff, we're able to hold the organic stuff and take in all the beautiful um, organic light codes that are available to us. So this is why I was guided to do this clearing um, for the summit. And... Look, I also feel called to say that if you haven't heard about AI in organics and um, these kind of distortions, there's nothing to fear about these distortions. Yes, I'm not going to lie, they can be annoying, um, like all lower frequencies, but they are just a frequency. So the sooner we move out of fear, um, the sooner we, you know, we really choose to move out of fear, we can make some really amazing soul progress and... You know, and to start to embody our sovereign divinity, which is what we were intended to do in the first place. So, um, yeah, the sooner we can not be afraid of these things, the better. So with that, let's get to the clearing. If I've got more time at the end, I'll, I can talk a little bit more about it, but I really want to get the clearing done. So if you can, if you're in a position to lie down, um, please do so. If you can't, then try and make yourself as comfortable as possible. I'm actually just going to put my headphones in, actually, just to cut out any background noise for the clearing. Um, so also hydration is really important for these clearings. We're purging a lot, so if you feel like you need a drink of water, um, I've got my coconut water here, so. But I'll also prompt you to have some water at the end, okay? You don't need to know what all the details are of the things that I'm clearing. Um, just simply allow the transmission to flow through you, open up to the clearing without overthinking it, uh, and just make sure you breathe. And I'll prompt you to breathe through some of it. I'll be sealing the group space. I'll be calling in the guardians and other healing support teams, all from the law of one, to support this transmission. So this is a very safe container for opening up to, to clearing. Okay. All right, so I hope everybody's nice and got themselves in a position where they're comfortable. Starting to relax and taking nice, long, slow breaths in through the nose and releasing out through the mouth. And with every out breath, you feel yourself release more and more tension from your whole body. I state that this clearing and activation is for all those here in this now moment, but also for those who listen at another now moment. I call forward from the highest kingdoms of heaven, from the law of one, all guardian alliance groups and all protector force angels to open a pillar 
to the 13th dimensional space, this pillar is where all released energies will be sent back to source for transmutation. Now call forward from the highest kingdoms of heaven, from the law of one mother, father, God, and all 12 Elohim to circle and surround the group, creating a chamber of healing. Activating your crystals and pillars of light as each pillar of light activates, it anchors down through the earth, down to the crystalline core of Mother Gaia and extends up through the sun to the great central sun, anchoring heaven on earth around us and sealing this group. I call forward from the highest kingdoms of heaven, from the law of one, angels of ultraviolet fire, come in and seal all openings, spaces, black holes, portals, vortexes, preventing any lower energies and beings from entering into this space. And I call forward and welcome with love and gratitude from the highest kingdoms of heaven, from the law of one, the Aurora Guardians, the Crystal Star Guardians, the Emerald Order, Gold Order and Amethyst Order and the Galactic Medical Teams, I ask that you be with us and assist each individual here now and later in this clearing and reconnection healing. And I call in every being's higher self to be present. And I ask that you hold and guide each individual, giving them the strength that they need to open to this clearing, to release all that does not serve so they receive the energies of divine God source. Mother, Father and Christ of you, God, we have reached a time in our ascension when we are more ready than ever before to clear and release the organic dis inorganic distortions from our planet, from our auric fields and our blueprints. Now bringing your awareness to your beautiful, sacred heart centre, breathing in source light from all around you. Organic source light, breathe that all in. And feeling into this light, a big, beautiful, golden sphere of organic source light flooding and filling your entire heart space. I start to expand this ball of golden light both up and down until the light reaches your throat chakra and your solar plexus chakra just under your ribs. Feel this golden energy soak right into your whole body, into your chakras. And expanding out further now, the golden ball reaches your sacral and your third eye chakras. Feeling into the warmth of the gold light, soaking it all in. And expanding further out, the golden light of source energy reaches your crown and your root chakras. All of your chakras are now being bathed with golden source light energy. This golden ball of source light is now nurturing your whole field. Breathe that all in. And with this, we get to know and sense how your connection to organic source light feels. Tune into that. Now that you're completely surrounded by organic source and connected, we are going to commence clearing your 12 dimensional spaces of inorganic AI frequencies that serve to disconnect us from our higher self. Starting at the 12th dimension along both the horizontal and the vertical planes, I request clearing of all scalar tags, black boxes, Moloch software, reversal codes, miasms, soul signal blocks, including all backup files, zeta seals, j seals, cogs, plates, cords, tapping, false matrix siphons and imprints, negative firewalls, negative implants. Clear and send them all to the pillar for transmutation now. Breathe that all out, let it go. All that needs to go, just release. And now we're flooding and filling this dimensional space with organic divine source light, replacing all that has been removed with new organic light, breathing in the new light. And 
going to move quite quickly through the higher dimensions and spend some more time in the lower. So moving into the 11th dimension along both the horizontal and the vertical planes, I request clearing of all scalar tags, black boxes, Molex software, reversal codes, Miasm, Sol Sigma blocks, including backup files, Zeta seals, J seals, cogs, plates, cords, tapping, false matrix siphons and their imprints, all negative firewalls and negative implants. Clear and send all to the pillar for transmutation now. I'm breathing that out, letting it all go. Flooding and filling this dimensional space now with organic divine source, replacing all cleared energy, breathing in the new light. So breathing in. Moving on to the 10th dimension. Along both the horizontal and the vertical planes. Clearing all scalar tags, black boxes, Molex software, reversal codes, miasms, soul signal blocks, including backup files. Zeta seals, J seals, cogs, plates, cords, tapping, false matrix siphons and their imprints, negative firewalls and negative implants. Clear and send all to the pillar for transmutation now. Let it all go, breathing out for the release. Now breathing in as we flood and fill this dimension with organic source light, replacing all that has been removed. Breathing in the new light. Breathing that in. Now moving on to the ninth dimension. Along both horizontal and the vertical planes, I request clearing of all scalar tags, black boxes, Molex software, reversal networks, miasms, soul signal blocks, including backup files, zeta seals, j seals, cogs, plates, cords, tapping, false matrix siphons and imprints, negative firewalls and negative implants. Remove and send all to the pillar for transmutation now. Let it all go, breathe out. And now flood and fill this dimension with organic divine source light, bringing in and replacing organic source light to replace all the removed energy, breathing in this light. Moving on to the eighth dimension, along both horizontal and the vertical planes. I request clearing of all scalar tags, black boxes, Molex software, reversal networks, miasms, soul signal blocks, including all backup files, zeta seals, j seals, cogs, plates, cords, tapping, false matrix siphons and their imprints, all negative firewalls and negative implants. Clear and send all to the pillar for transmutation now. Let it all go, release. Now flooding and filling this eighth dimension with organic divine source light and we're replacing all removed energy with new organic energy, breathing in. Moving now to the seventh dimension, along both the horizontal and the vertical planes. I request clearing of all scalar tags, black boxes, Molex software, all reversal networks, miasms, all soul signal blocks, including all backup files, zeta seals, j seals, cogs, plates, cords, tapping, false matrix siphons and their imprints, negative firewalls and negative implants. Remove and send all to the pillar for transmutation now. Breathing out. Release and letting it go. Having this stuff built up in our seventh dimension can really impact us from taking in our divine power. 
and accessing that power. Now flood and fill this dimension with organic divine source light, replacing all that was cleared, breathing in the new. Breathing it in. Moving into the sixth dimensional space along both the horizontal and the vertical planes. We're requesting clearing of all scalar tags, all black boxes, Moloch software, reversal networks, Myers and Soul signal blocks, including all backup files. Zeta seals, J seals, cogs, plates, or cords tapping, or false matrix siphons and imprints, or negative firewalls and negative implants. Clear and send them all to the pillar of transmutation now. Read that all out. Let it all go, release. Now we're going to flood and fill this dimensional space, the six dimensional space, with organic divine source light, replacing all of the cleared energy with organic energy, breathing in the new source light, breathing that in. And let all that new light come in. Moving into the fifth dimensional space, along horizontal and vertical planes, I request clearing of all scalar tags, black boxes, Moloch software, reversal networks, miasms, all soul signal blocks, including all backup files, CETA seals, J seals, cogs, plates, cords, tapping, or false matrix siphons and their imprints, negative firewalls and negative implants. Clear and remove. Send them all to the pillar for transmutation now. Breathing out, letting it all go. Freeing up your throat chakra, your fifth dimensional space. This is where your soul matrix is as well, or part of it. Good. Release and letting it go. Now we're going to flood and fill this dimension with organic divine source light, replacing all cleared energy. Breathe in the new organic light. Breathe it all out. And moving into the fourth dimension, on both the horizontal and the vertical planes, I request clearing of all scalar tags, black boxes, or Moloch software reversal networks, or miasms, soul signal blocks, including their backup files, or Zeta seals, J seals, cogs, plates, cords tapping, or false matrix siphons, and all negative imprints, negative firewalls, and negative imprints. Clear and send all to the pillar for transmutation now. Leave it all out. Let this go. Let this stuff go. So this is the astral dimension. A lot of gunk, I suppose, gets built up here. We want to breathe it all out. Release consciously. Let it all go. Now flood and fill this dimensional space with organic divine source light by replacing all cleared energy, all that has been removed or replacing with new. Breathe in the new light. Big breath in. Now the fourth dimension is just being bathed with all of this new 
source one. Helping to open up and activate that beautiful heart center. The heart center is a big key to our incension, ascension journey. And moving into the third dimension along both the horizontal and the vertical planes. I request clearing of all scale attacks, black boxes, Molex software, reversal networks, miasms, all soul signal blocks, including all backup files, zeta seals, j seals, cogs, plates, cords, all tapping, all false matrix siphons and their imprints, negative firewalls, negative imprints, clear and send them all to the pillar for transmutation now. Letting that all go, breathing it out. Release. A big one to release here. At the third, we have the mental grid. Lots of distortions here and creating potential neurological loops. Uh, we might experience thoughts that are not ours. We really want to um, react better to the way other people think as well. So releasing the aura and breathing it out. is a big one. This lower four chakras are quite targeted by inorganics. So now we're going to flood and fill this dimensional space, the third dimensional space, with organic divine source light, replacing all that has been removed, breathing in organic source light. Breathe that all in now. Feel that new light coming in. And moving into the second dimension, along both the horizontal and the vertical planes, I request clearing of all scalar tags, black boxes, Molex software, reversal networks, miasms, soul signal blocks, including all backup files, zeta seals, j seals, cogs, plates, cords, tapping, false matrix siphons and imprints, Negative firewalls, negative imprints, clear and send all to the pillar for transmutation now. Let it all go. Breathing out, release. And releasing all of this from the emotional grid in the second. We can also have a lot of distortions here. Uh, we can pick up emotions that are not ours, impacting the way... We respond to our emotions, so let that all go, breathe that all out, release. Moving into the first dimensional space now, along the horizontal and the vertical planes, I request clearing of all scalar tags, black boxes, Molex software, reversal networks, miasms, soul signal blocks, including all backup files, zeta seals, j seals, cogs, plates, cords, tapping, false matrix siphons and their imprints, all negative firewalls, all negative implants clear and send all to the pillar for transmutation now. Breathing this out, letting it go, big release. This is where we store our old traumas that can get stuck in this grid and the inorganic Frequencies like to play on those, so let's release, let it go, breathe it all out. And now flooding and filling this dimension with organic divine source light, replacing all cleared energy now, breathing in the new organic energy, breathing that in. Breathing organic source light in. Good job, so we've gone through all of the 12 dimensional spaces and when we clear more distortions, we make room for greater amounts of the organic source energy that we can hold in our light bodies. Just relax into that. Now calling in healing codes from the Holy Mother, the Holy Father and the Holy Christ Sophia, the Trinity Flame. The Trinity Flame of Aqua, 
blue fire for Holy Mother, magenta violet fire for Holy Father, and gold fire for Christ Sophia. Bring the flame 12 inches below the feet at the Earth Star Chakra. Bring this flame in. And pulling up this flame up through everyone's central vertical channel, pulling it all up and on the way as we pull it up, clearing all inorganic distortions in the central vertical channel along the way up and send them all to the pillar for transmutation now. Pulling it all the way up, all the way. I'm requesting a gentle balancing and strengthening of the central vertical channel. This allows more of our prana, our vital force energy to flow through us. Now gently expanding the trinity flame out from the channel, out to the whole energy field. Feel your whole field is now bathed in divine rainbow opalescent light, radiating soothing healing codes. And these codes, they support your connection to your divine God sovereign truth. Breathing in these rainbow healing codes. Breathing in. Our highest God Self Consciousness knows that we are not victims and our highest God Self Consciousness knows that we are powerful co-creators reconnecting with the truth of our divinity. As we clear and release we move closer to creating unity consciousness, feeling unconditional love and embodying our sovereignty. Our inner knowing that we are the rainbow bridge here, returning heaven to earth. This is the way it was always intended. Now sending all energy back to each person, completely and totally. I call my energy back to myself, completely and totally. And I give infinite thanks, love and gratitude for all the guardians, all the healing and angelic teams, Mother, Father, God, my highest support and ascension teams. Thank you, thank you, thank you for coming in and being with us today. And as we complete this transmission, just bring your awareness back into the physical. We want to ground all of our energy back, feeling the surface beneath you. If you feel you want to gently open your eyes and wiggle your fingers and toes, coming back into the body, feeling energy coming back through the body. Oh, I've just done this in time. That's great. I hope that you're all feeling okay. Please. Water, that's essential now. We're purging and clearing a lot with these kind of clearings, so um, we do need to rehydrate. I want to quickly mention I've got a summit offer for everyone in the group um, for all bookings made until the 12th of February. I'm offering a 15% discount on all of my healing and clearing programs. I've got five of those. My programs um, have anywhere from two to six sessions together so we work together a little bit more than just the one and the discount code for this offer is summit 15 i'll put up a separate post for that um, after this okay so i hope everyone is um, feeling okay and can go gentle with themselves today for the rest of the day or for the night where you are so bye for now beautiful um, souls i'm going to just say that up next we've got amanda i think she, amanda's the last presenter for the summit for today and I think what Amanda's presenting about is just such a beautiful follow-up to what I've just done. So calibrating the body to its new wisdom. That's I love the sound of that, Amanda. So thank you everyone for joining me and enjoy the rest of the summit. Much love and blessings. Bye for now.